Okay. Okay, I was muted, but I just hit my head really hard. I just hit my Ma. head really hard. I just hit my head really hard on my desk. Ah. Oh god, I just hit my head really hard on my desk. How I was I was Ma. looking for my glasses, you know the su funny sunglasses I wear when I when the stream starts, I wear some funny sunglasses and they were on the ground. And I reached down to grab them, and I hit my head on my microphone arm really hard. I hit my head on my microphone arm really hard. Oh. We're on the way! Hold 
on. Stream starting. Mom. Whoa, hey everybody! Whoa, it's crazy that the stream is starting. Oh yeah, it's left a deep cut in your forehead. There's a big line on your head where you hit it. TBJ hit their head so hard, there's a big fucking dent in their forehead now. Does anyone else want to make that joke? Anyone else want to want to jump on and start making that joke as well? Does it line in forehead? That's good. That's good. Hold on. Hold on a second. There we go. How's everybody doing today? I do have the line. I do have the line on me again. I have the line of lights from the blinds. I don't know how to fix it. It's. I'm not gonna put like a whole. Oh yay! I really like the town crier. Can I just say I really like the town crier? I'm like I'm a big fan of the town crier. I like it a lot. On the way. Hey, th let's thank some subscribers that came in. Hold on. Uh, where did it start? There it is. Captain John Star, thanks for the eight months. Great to see you. What's up, Normal Liz? Thanks for the six months. Problem Haver, thank you for the nine months. Uh, sure. Pretty good. Shark Jack Zack, thank you for the nine months. Hazel. On the way. Hazley, thank you so much for 10 months. Jamberg for the 10 as well. Thank you so much. Colin, nine months. Nine months without a head injury is why I'm on the way. Fuck. Way to go, DBJ. Nine months without a head injury. It's why I subscribe to your stream, and here's to nine more. Great. Uh, the Birthday Spider, thanks for the seven months. Minty, uh, thank you for the 30 months. Two and a half years, Minty. Can you believe that? Two and a half years. I'm on the way. Minty, you're getting close to having the, um, the skull that I think only two people have the diamond skull right and you just unlocked the um my favorite sub badge which is hold on can i show it here yeah. Yeah. On the, way. the blown up skull i really i really like the blown up skull that's my favorite sub badge i enjoy i enjoy it a lot <clears throat> is dbj quiet um, I don't think so. Am I coming through quietly? He's quiet for me too. Huh. Did I change anything? I don't think I changed anything. Sounds good. Okay. But. Okay. Quieter than usual. Hmm. <laughs> right there so I can watch Wow Wow Whoopsie while I'm at Walmart. everybody sorry about the uh the tech stuff how's everybody doing on a monday i'm very excited for today's show very very excited you're quieter than you were before i'm not now you are quiet nothing changed now one goes like this 
sideways. And the other Everything one but is Jesse is very loud. No, sticking that's, like this. that's me being quieter. I can yeah, see all the settings. Here's, here's my foot, right? It's sticking up like this. Push it down, it pops Bye. back up. They're locked up. They're locked up. Hold on. I have an idea. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to try something really fast. Okay. Uh, to fix the audio. Let's see. Does this help at all? Is this better at all? Is that like a better, is that a better volume? Good. Sounds good. Sounds good. Yes. Thank you. Okay, good. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's what I'm doing. Better. Yep. I'll, I'll take a closer look into why it was so quiet before. Mm -hmm. um, I can only hear ringing now. Hi, everybody. Uh, We're on the way. Saturday show was so much fun. Saturday show was amazing. It was so much, so much, so much fun. Um, big hand to Matt and Luke who made that show so funny and so fun. If you haven't seen it, watch the VOD, oh, genuinely. Yeah. It might it might have been the best stream of the year so far, in my opinion. Just, just based on pure funniness, it might have been the best one so far. Um, there's been a lot of competition this year so far, but I mean, it was it was pretty good. Luke stole the show. I, I said, Luke, I'm setting up the pins. You better knock them down. And he fucking blasted it. So good. Three hour same video stream is going to top it. So on Thursday, so here's, here's something to talk about. First off, I've decided on what the new schedule is going to be to be more sustainable. The new core schedule is Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. Okay which is pairing it back. Uh, Monday is locked in forever. Wednesday is locked in forever and could be anything. Saturday is locked in forever, okay? Additional, but most weeks, I'm probably gonna wanna do four shows, maybe even five. So on Tuesday or Thursday, those are gonna be the days that I'm gonna add other shows. Please join the Discord and look at schedule stuff in the Discord for weekly up on Sunday. I'm gonna be posting the schedule for the week every Sunday. Uh, so just check it there. And, you know, like this week, I'm doing, today is the Monday, I'm doing videos. Uh, Wednesday is going to be uh, Skyrim Crowd Control, which people have been telling me to do for like, since I did the first Crowd Control stream back in January. Very excited to try that out. Um, Skyrim Crowd Control on Wednesday. Thursday is gonna be watching one video for three hours which I said I was going to do two weeks ago before I had to take a little bit of a break. And I'm looking forward to it. I actually am. I think it's going to do something weird to us. I think it's going to be doing... I think it's going to do something weird to us on Thursday. Uh, Seminex did not win. No. The one that won is Matrix Lord 212, my PS5 gets sick. Which I think is maybe the best option. I think that that is probably the best option. Um, just for the effect that I'm going for. Uh, so Thursday should be a lot of fun. Should, I, I'm, I'm actually, I know everyone's gonna be like, it's miserable. I think it'll be really interesting. I think it'll be really interesting to see what it does to us. Um, so that's gonna be on Thursday. On Saturday, I'm gonna be doing a mini-a-thon where subs can extend it and I might do like a six hour show on Saturday. Which is pretty, it's the longest show that I've done since the last subathon, so I just wanted to do a big chunky one, you know, I, on a Saturday. I just wanted to do a big long one, and this is a great reason to. Um, and yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be this. He's uh, gay. Yep, uh, and that's gonna be this week. I'm really looking forward to this week. Do you guys think we should do the hello joke? I know I'm actually. We're on the way. I'm actually a little bit demure at the beginning of the stream. A little bit demure. Um, and slower than usual, but that's because I'm so tired and I'm trying to pace myself. And we got a lot of fucking good videos that I'm sure are going to make me lose my fucking mind. So I'm trying to take it easy uh, early on. But let's say hello to all of our wonderful friends. Manju, great to see you. What's up, Rocket Powered Zombie and Scrollston? Minty, great to see you. Hark, Garyless Monolith, Namaste, and Rock on Moonbase Boss. Popcorn Pigeon, great to see you. What's up, Cryptid and Rasher? What's up, Ron Maiden, Magical Johnson? 
Uh, let me thank some subs. Enron Advocate, thanks for the 10 months. Cash Gordon, thanks for the nine months. Thank you so much. And thanks for the raid from Exercise Machine. Hey, Ideal Copy, great to see you. Uh, Deusteru, we bong nuts. On the way. Lilac, thank you for the nine months. Normal Liz, Rally V, Colin, great to see you. What's up, Moltarbin and Cash Gordon. Copy, great to see you. What's up, Axe from Bleep. Snaky Tugboats, Jamberg, Whitey Corn, great to see you. What's up, ECT and the Chomsky hash? We got a great, we got a lot of videos to get through today. We got a lot of videos to get through today. Agent Whiskey Danger, great to see you. What's up, Spence and Booty Butt Vagina and Bog Snot, Wibbity Wabbity, Grizzy Tron, Mel, Uncle Beef, Afro Gun. So, listen, there's too many people here. There's too many people here. Uh, what do you guys say we get right into it? I know that usually I do banter. I mean, last time I talked about the fucking blinds for 45 minutes. But I think that I, I think we should just get into it. What do you say? Okay. Let's start with a good energy and the good energy. God says it's over if you ignore me today. It's over. My beloved child, if you're going through hard times, know that I love you very much and want to help you get through them. Okay. You've come to me today because you believe I can help you get back on your feet. I do. Heal your wounds. I do. Forget about the past. I had too much candy uh, while I was doing Luke's stream last night. I was up a lot. I was up later than I meant to good be. Good things that were once yours. Yes. Please know that I love and respect you. I'm and sleepy. And your strength in the face of hardship makes me very happy. Okay. Trust and He's believe great. that I, your dependable <laughs> and all-powerful God, am with you. Don't worry about people who might make fun of you. Or this seems specific. <laughs> this one seems specific. Is this happening? Is this the main problem most people are going through? Is people making fun of them? People who might make That's fun. That's my main issue. Is that everybody's main issue? Of you, or try to take away your happiness. They're not really your friends. They're just people who have lost faith and are jealous of the path you've chosen. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, DBJ, God here. Don't worry about anyone calling you divorced or line head or anything like that. Where's the line? I don't have a line. I don't have a line on my forehead. They are aware that you are loved and blessed, but they can't accept this. Do not waste your time trying to persuade them. I will take away all the people who want to hurt you and bring into your life those who truly love you. Gonna kill them? Let go of your sadness and don't let worry or... Th <laughs> hey, cr hey, Christ above, get your fucking kerning in order. What the fuck is this? <laughs> How does this even happen? How does this happen in your text software? Dante let worry. Let go of your sadness and Dante let worry. Let worry. Dante let worry. Dante let worry. I Sorry. I'm tired. I'm going to get into these fucking like feedback loops because I'm loopy today. I need to warn everybody that I am actually really tired. Um, and I wasn't able to, I was like completely useless all day today. Arlie Ermy. It's, it's an Arlie Ermy situation. Giggle puss mode. I haven't gotten into giggle puss mode yet. I'm trying. That's what I'm trying to prevent. But there's gonna be one video today, and I don't know what it's gonna be. I'm sure there's gonna be one, and I'm just gonna fucking fall apart and just be laughing for like five straight minutes, and it's gonna be the least entertaining thing you've ever seen. God says, don't lose everything by skipping. Jesus. My beloved child, I come to you with a message of love, guidance. <laughs> okay, so fly. And hope. Open your hearts and ears. He's flying around. To receive the words I offer you today. Okay. At this moment, I give you a simple yet profound task. Okay. Make you Just banana listen. pancakes, pretend that it's the weekend. <laughs> yes, God. Yes, Christ. Please, God, praise me. <laughs> you run into the kitchen. Darling, where are the bananas? We're out of bananas! My child, listen to your heart. You, praise be to banana pancakes, and thou shalt pretend it's the weekend. 
Okay, we're done with this. That's that's basically the, on the way. Oops. That's the most that we could ever hope to get out of that. Okay, so I wanted to do this before I forgot. I always forget when there, when it's a video. Somebody submitted in the Discord. Hold on. Is it in submissions? I want to make sure that I get it right. Yeah, Kukulin submitted this in the Discord as a submission. And it was just uh, somebody on the... It was like the person making the announcements on the train. And you got to listen to what this guy sounds like. I have no fucking clue what kind of at times it seems like a Bayou Cajun chef at times it, it seems posh like he's like instructing you not to touch the the vase at the estate uh like i have no idea where this the is obama ball celebrating the game president barack obama thank you white dead blossom jesse for continuing your gifted sub to a tier one thank you thank you so much he said adelaide he's this is australian he sounds crazy he sounds crazy I just thought it was really funny. What? Well, some of the finest security guards. Play it again? No. I'm not going to do that. Oh, while I... I wanted to talk about this also. While I was doing um, prep for the medieval stream on Saturday, um, something came up. Hold on. Let me, let me just get this rearranged. Yeah. Um, and I was just looking through stuff. And I found this thing. Hear ye, hear ye. Town crier helps citizens understand COVID-19 rules in Annapolis. <laughs> which, which I, this is just so bizarre. This is so strange. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye. Tis common sense that all citizens... <laughs> Observe a put a mask on. A safe Why aren't you wearing one? Social distance during the current emergency. The distance of six feet or two hogs or three good sized rockfish. Everyone's fucking insane. In May 2020, everyone's fucking insane. Everyone's fucking deranged. Everyone's insane. Or one. Nobody knows what the fuck is happening. Everyone's lost their minds. They think the world is over. Small robot. This guy isn't even wearing his mask right. Look, he's got the N95, but he's got only one of the straps and it's like under his ears. This guy's wearing it fucking wrong as hell. This is awesome. Also, what's awesome is you can see the town crier's bell and bottle of water in this shot. <laughs> so you know that he was the one filming it. So he was definitely the guy behind the camera in this shot. And then he had someone else do the, the reverse shot. Which is awesome. Hear ye! Shut the fuck up! Jesus, you're annoying. You are so annoying. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Can you imagine? He's violating all the rules. He's getting really close to people. He doesn't have a mask on. <laughs> He's... <laughs> He's... Hear ye! And there's apparently a second town crier based on the sound of it. There's a second town crier far, like, in the background. That all citizens practice good... Okay, the second town crier needs to shut up while we're watching videos. ...sanitation and clean their hands frequently. In my day, we didn't have hand sanitizer, public restrooms, or decent towels. I'd have to wipe my hands on the Tory. 
This guy needs to fucking lose it. This guy needs to, like, lose the bell. Like, for real needs to lose the bell. We didn't have decent towels. Did he say on a Tory? I don't know what he said. I don't know what he said, to be honest. I have no fucking idea. I have no idea. No running during COVID. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye. Just common sense that all citizens wear a face mask when in public. Oh, is it? Bah. Is it? Is it Mr. Town Crier? Is it Mr. Town Crier? It's not a gun. He wasn't going to shoot. He might chance to encounter another citizen, even whilst jogging. It is common sense to have a face mask on hand. Mine is extra large. Looks kind of small to me. So I just, that made me fucking insane. That just made me fucking insane trying to watch that. That just made me insane. I, did he upload after this? I mean, that's the Annapolis, Maryland official YouTube channel, which is mostly recordings of town hall meetings, which are, I actually did look into them. They are some of the most boring things you've ever seen in your whole fucking life. Okay. <coughs> I had considered, um, on the way. I'd considered removing the medieval sound alerts. Um, cause I was like, well, maybe they won't be funny if it's not medieval stream. And I was right. They're not funny. This is Kane masters. Learn five essential Kane moves wherever you go. Uh, the most powerful strikes with a cane are, we call the power five. <laughs> Fucking Magic the Gathering term. And we've given them numbers but. to make them easy. The first is a number one. It's a cross. I love, I love the big fucking foam cane. The big fucking foam cane that it's like, I got to use this or I'm going to kill you. I got to make sure, <laughs> I got to make sure it's not a real cane or my, you could be dead. You might be killed. One. It's a cross shot. It comes up and comes back. This is a powerful but. shot. This is a number one. The reverse is a number You're two. You're just hitting. That's not the a second move. Is a number three, which is horizontal. <laughs> the first one is you swing the cane. The second one is you swing the cane. And the four is back. What? It's not that crazy. It's not that crazy. He's got a second cane. Calm down. All right? Calm down. Don't be don't be in my chat like I hope he does cane move number 6 to my pussy. Don't be like that. All right? We're like half an hour into the stream. I don't want to end. It's Monday. Yeah. It's Monday. <laughs> 500 people looking at this old dude's cock. That does make it funny. That does make it a little bit funny, but it also makes me feel sick to my stomach. You're the only person who said that? I'm seeing people in chat be like, be like, hey, I love to see, I want him to do cane move number seven where he fucking crooks his dick and the into my penis. Cock is a dissecting. Don't tell me how many viewers are watching the stream. You come across and you come up into a ready position. Those five are strokes that you can deliver with enormous speed and power. <laughs> I like this guy a lot. I do like this guy a lot. Okay, what's this one? How to quick draw your cane. <laughs> <laughs> Who's holding their cane like this? <laughs> Who's got their cane like this? What are you, crazy? Have you ever been walking around with your cane hanging from your wrist? And you wonder, how, how can I possibly hit someone with this? First problems people confront is, 
well, what do I do with my cane when I'm shopping and I want to hold something? Well, most of us figure out you can simply hang it on your arm. You can use an ATM machine. You can pick up a product. Yep. But there's actually... You can pick up a product. We're on the way! Chomsky, thanks for the seven months. Seven months. Two ways to hold the cane. If you hold it... What's going on in the background? It does look like he's in, like, a lighthouse or something. To the outside, you have one series of options on what you can do. One series if of you options. hold it to the inside, there's a totally different series of options on how you could use the cane. And learning the difference between the two is the first thing you should master. I hope... I don't think that this guy probably is... Well, maybe he is evil. Why? How would I know one way or the other? Okay, here's what I've here's what I've got to say. I hope I'm not 75 years old, still fantasizing about beating someone's ass. I hope I hope that I'm not like 75 and I'm still hoping that someone crosses me so that I can feel like I'm fucking Steven Seagal, like. Like that's, that's really still, I'm saying, I'm saying like people feel, I can kind of at least understand if you're like 25 and you haven't gotten your shit together and you're fucking angry at everything and you're looking for anything to keep you together. Maybe that makes sense to me, but like 75, like <laughs> Colin, thanks for the gifted sub to Kane me 28, not 25. Can I show another thing that was posted on the Discord? I know I, this is just becoming oh, dis Discord night. Somebody said this was me. Somebody said this is me saying I'm 28. How old are you? How old are you? I'm... Uh, <laughs> let me see. I am 29. <laughs> Which made me so mad. That made me so mad when I saw that. I'm like, I'm not, first off, I'm not even 29 yet. I'm 29 in like seven months. So, you know, and don't send that to me on my 29th birthday, okay? So to access your cane. Huge 31 energy. My ass is not 31. All right. It drops and then I can go into a striking position. And I'm gonna have, once I'm in a ready position, I'm sitting here shopping, I'm gonna have him clap his hands. I thought you were 40, non-subscriber, following since December, sorry. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I need to show you. I actually, I never do this. I need to show you guys the, what I'm seeing. Following since December. Do you guys want to see the chat history of not ritual? the whole history that's all they've said it's the only thing they said they've been following since december 22nd what, what were you wait what were you waiting you were like waiting for me to drop my guard what was happening insane ratio vip 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 no wait what I can't just VIP everyone that owns my ass, okay? I can't, as much as I would like to. I gotta, I gotta use my own discretion. Because what if, what if the person turns out to be crazy? Then I don't know. Really weird to be watching for so long without chatting. That's from Mr. Fentanyl. Let's see. Following since July 23rd, 2023. First time chat. <laughs> uh, 
All right. You know what? I wasn't going to do it for the other guy. But I I got to say, I, I think that I think I think Mr. Fentanyl earned it. I, I think I think Mr. Fent Fentanyl opened it. I I I mean opened it. I think uh I think I think they earned it. Just being honest. Okay. Stressful amount of tabs. That is not how I live my life. It's just how I get ready for the show. I just want to make that clear. Hold on. Let's just watch this for a second. High sheer mixer granulator. Woo! Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is good! Blew my ears out? I'm sorry it was so loud. I'm sorry it was so loud. But it was pretty- It's got a unique impeller design! You must be tripping. It's got a manifold spray for binder edition. Oh my God. Jesse, do you just use really low impedance headphones or what's up? Are you asking why the stream is so loud? I want you to know um, that everything that you're hearing is 10 dB down from what I'm hearing. Just in case, if you think that, if you think the stream is loud, it's 10 dB down from what I'm hearing. Why? To make sure it's not too loud. <laughs> That's the real reason. <laughs> Sensor detects bola in place. Hanningfield Uni Mill. Oh, fuck. Bro, just read this. Doesn't this just... just Doesn't this just, like, feel good to think? Like, read in your head? Hanningfield Uni Mill for gentle size calibration of wet lumps. Hanningfield, Hanningfield Uni Mill for gentle size calibration of wet lumps. Really good. Damn, that shit rules. That shit is really good. I really enjoy that shit. Um, this is somebody submitted something to, um, Somebody submitted something to the Family Guy live stream. This was submitted. I don't know what this is. Apparently, you can, like, submit prompts to this auto, like, AI live stream. As someone... <laughs> Cleveland's top bacterial infections. All right, everybody gather around. I'm gonna list the top 50 bacterial infections. Turn it down. Is it really... Ugh, dude, the audio mixing on today's stream is so fucked up. I'm so sorry. I don't know why it's... I don't know why it's so messed up. Seems fine to me.
Wow. Okay. I think I think that I can be heard. Okay. Can you guys hear this though? Yeah, you can. Okay. Okay. There's something wrong with my audio equipment. There's a loose wire or something. <laughs> oh yay! Okay. Here's what we heard. Please don't be that bad. Please don't be that bad. I don't know why it's so messed up. Seems fine to me. <laughs> I don't know why it's so messed up. <laughs> oh, that's messed up. That's fucked. That's totally fucked. <laughs> what happened? Sorry, what's happening in this fucking video? We told you? Hold on. This is the lowest it'll go, okay? All right, everybody gather around. We're gonna <laughs> lift the top 50 bacterial infections. Okay. All right. So everyone's like silent video. No, this is just turned down literally as low as it can possibly be turned. Why is it doing this? Why is it doing this? <laughs> why, why is it doing it? Making him say asterisk 30 times? I don't know. Hold on. Close Kane Masters. Here's a video that was submitted. I don't, it doesn't have a caption. And it's broken because of all of my audio shit. Okay. Children unintentionally gave birth. Wife who loves having children. And unintentionally gave birth to one billion of them and the one room couldn't possibly accommodate them all the husband decided to break through the entire floor of the building <laughs> okay a fresh renovation firstly okay. circular holes are excavated in the exterior walls of each floor that makes sense to me and exhaust fans are installed to ensure proper ventilation yep. then a bunch of galvanized square steel is uh -huh. purchased from the scrap yard yep you go to the scrap yard for welding wrapped in eco-friendly solid wood panels yep. a batch of mattresses is sourced from the garbage dump to provide to the dump from the dump. Provide individual bed spaces for all one billion children, ensuring they are separated to avoid mutual disturbance. Underneath each bed, long drawers are installed for the children. Is this a nightmare you had or what? Clothes and socks, while ladders are attached. Why are you telling me? Sides of the beds to make it easy for the children to go up and down. Remember to Is this just an idea? For both aesthetics and strength. Install elevators between floors for convenient movement. Avoid traditional. Did you have an idea or what is this can easily kick and break this didn't actually happen this didn't happen right this didn't really happen instead install titanium alloy doors <laughs> sorry what kind of doors were that steed install titanium alloy doors that <laughs> instead break instead Steve. install titanium alloy doors that instead install titanium to take how do how what does he even say? Instead, install titanium. Titanium. Instead, install titanium alloy doors. Alloy doors that can withstand any titanium alloy doors with any amount of pounding. Integrate a facial recognition system to prevent other people's children from entering. Set up snack racks to encourage a daily habit of snacking. On the left side, set up food stalls to cater to each child's taste. Place bookshelves on both sides. This is like if you let a schizophrenic man pitch to the Netflix executives. Like, and you just didn't stop him. He just has like two hours to just keep talking. Like. To the aisle to cultivate a reading habit among the children. Arrange desks and chairs. Not that many books. By the There's a billion children. As the children's study area with a statue of a scholar in the middle to inspire them <laughs> to pay homage every day for better academic. A statue of a scholar. Performance. With the house designed in this way. And they will pray to Lao Tzu. Accommodating one billion. That's a weird detail that they're also going to pray to Lao Tzu. And children becomes a breeze.
Like, okay, but if you can get those kids to earn $1 every day, you get $1 billion every day. Yo. I hadn't thought about... Holy... A billion dollars a day. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. I think I, I think I see what you're getting at. <laughs> I think I know what you're getting at. This next video is called Guy Breaks a Clock Ride at Chuck E. Cheese. can't do it <laughs> but i can't do it TikTok, he broke the clock it's a different wait it's a different breaking the same clock it's a different guy breaking the same clock ride at a different chuck e cheese TikTok, he broke the clock i can't do it i can't do it they can't they should have just made the clock. Do not put Big Boy on the clock. Oh, come on. Do not put Big Boy on the clock. That's... <laughs> Look, there's a child. I gotta say, this thing's fucking strong. I'm kind of shocked that the, the clock is able to get him up that high. I thought this would be the hard part. What's up, Hal? <laughs> now I want to ride the clock. What's... What's the game of the clock? I just realized, like, what are you... What is the point of this? What's the point of fun ride? Doesn't seem that fun. <laughs> Doesn't seem that fun. See, you ride it. I don't know. Just it's. I don't know if it's. I don't know if it's that compelling. Just for the sake of itself. I, I don't. <laughs> Try looking at it through the eyes of a child. Okay, I'm fucking terrified of the clock, and I want them to put a sheet over it. That's if I'm a child, I see this. I'm like, please don't do not put the child eating machine that eats children to cover it in something. <laughs> can you do clock face for us? On the way. I think I actually can. Something like that. Is that is that close? I couldn't see what it looked like. Was that close? <laughs> YouTube thumbnail face. I, I can't do it again. I can't do it when I'm seeing myself. <laughs> Bro. Bro, get off the clock. He got, he got, he got, he got scared. <laughs> tick tock he broke the clock tick tock he broke the clock people breaking the tick tock clock ride compilation is this the only thing people do at chuck e cheese is try to break the tick tock clock ride is that the only thing people are doing at chuck e cheese now is that hold on what is this this i hate this i hadn't seen what it looked like i fucking hate that that shit sucks not an emote no fucking chance that becomes an emote you got a no fucking chance i do not want to look at that i do not want to look at that ever I don't, I don't know. Emote for an enemy's channel? It would work better as a, as an enemy's emote, yeah. <laughs> that, 
that face he makes when he wants food cuddles or sex. Okay, let's watch the fucking TikTok clock compilation, please. We're on the way. Dropkick channel, thanks for the 10 months. This one's strong. Do they have, do the different clocks have different strengths? <laughs> ah! No, he was too, con I, I'm sorry. No, he. <laughs> that was the clock like in, like in an anime when someone does a technique that uses up their life span. That's what he did. <laughs> Four is the weak point. Yep. Hey, Splinker Bell. Thank you so much for the gifted sub, and unfortunately, I cannot read who you gave it to, but thank you so much. I swear to God, if you post this on your story, I'm going to <laughs> and it just it also just hangs loose it just it just hangs loose and just starts to swing this kind of just makes me sad costs a shit ton to fix it's Chuck E. Cheese it's okay it's Chuck E. Cheese like, it's okay. Uh, wait, we already watched... Sorry, I, I had a video up, but I was like, we watched that on a previous stream. Okay, Dodds Hulk. Gordy, inventory's getting out of hand. Leather, mattresses, recliner. There's no more room. What, what are, are we, we gonna, gonna do? do? You don't want to get Gordy Dodd angry because he turns <laughs> into the outrageous <laughs> overstocked bulk. That means blasting through yes! the big savings of Dodd's furniture. Yes! <laughs> Hey, <laughs> Splinker Bell, thanks for the gifted sub to give me my money back. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. What is this? Hold on. Before we finish this. My young adult. My <laughs> oh, okay. Let's go back. My young adult son breaks a clock ride at Chuck E. Cheese's during the midway. What will happen to my son's outcome? I don't. <sighs> I hate that picture. I should not have made that face. I should not have made that fucking face. I really, I feel like I'm going to be looking at it for the rest of 2024 for real. And I'm like, like I can feel it's like looking at storm clouds blowing in. It's like the wind that blows before a big storm. Like, <sighs> Dodds are stocked bulk. Ah! That means blasting through with big, big savings at Dodds Furniture. Help clear out the extra stock for every room in your house. You'll find quality selection and guarantees. Look out for the outrageous overstock bulk. Is he going to be in there when I'm in the store? Is he going to be in there when I'm in the store? Because I just want to, like, if I want to go in and get it like a couch or something, like, is he going to, is he going to be in there too or? And he is a problem. He'll load it up for you. What do you say? We won't be undersold. Da Dad's furniture and ma well, if that one was as as good as that, this one must be great. Space, the final frontier. <laughs> yes. Hi, Captain. You can choose your space with a Serda. Don't cling on to Okay, I don't know about this one, Chief. That old mattress, dual comfort sort of mattresses let you have softer firm on the same mattress. Boldly <laughs> dream like you never dreamed before. Be oh. Thanks for the gift and sub to Hel Hel Hulk Toes. Keep on board to the side that's right for you. And the Dodds set your savings for stunning. Captain, you won't be undersold? Make it so. Make it so. Logical choice. Live long and sleep. I like him a lot. I like Dodd a lot. Indiana Dodd? 
Indiana Dodd? I'm no stranger to these local commercials. This guy rules. This shit rules. It's like, it's Dodd and his like two friends. It's like his two friends. Dodd's furniture and mattress. You'll find furniture treasure for your entire home. Be a raider of the incredible selection. It's a kingdom of classic to contemporary designs. Or make it your last crusade for the perfect mattress. The adventure of savings never ends for Indiana Dodd. I want to end a song. Dodd's furniture and mattress. And the fact that it's like confusing and he played his theme song like three times at like bad times during the during the commercial I'm saving. like is really what is this? That's okay. That's okay. I'm not mad. I was paid to curse this man with AIDS by his aunt. Entire cake. Thank you so much for the ten dollars eleven cents. Thank you so much. I believe that was maybe an attempt to play the secret variation, which I think I deleted. Yeah, I think I deleted the uh, the secret variation, which is this one. <laughs> This, this, I, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I just like <laughs> I just like this a lot. I just I like it a lot. It's good. It's good. Unfortunately, it's really good. Hold on. We got to at least watch this part. We got to watch this part at least. Yeah, it's the whole scene vocoded to Gangster's Paradise. Yep. All right, that's enough. That's okay. Just for the record, that has been deleted. We're never going to see it again. Zarenki, thank you for the eight months. Thank you so much. Is, are there more Dodds? Yes, there are more Dodds. People of Victoria, come on down. You can be the next to say that. Dodds furniture and mattress. Look at the shorties. You start with furniture. Did he say, look at the shorties? Look at the shorties. Did he say, look at the shorties? <laughs> I know he said showcase, but it's he sounded like he was saying, look at the shorties. You start with furniture. For the Which would be funny if he said that. <laughs> Do not look at the main channel of your Discord right now. Just the fucking face over and over again. It's just a million of the face. Living room. And for the bedroom, mattresses firm, soft. I'm sorry that the horns woke up your cat. I apologize. And in between. What about the dining room? Classic to contemporary. It's all here, and the price is right. And the gas? You won't be undersold? You're right. Yeah! <laughs> Look at him. Look at, oh, Jesus, this guy on the left looks scary. <laughs> this guy on the left looks really scary in this, in this pause. He looks like Saturn devouring his son. <laughs> Butterball. He looks really scary. He looks really, really scary. Come down and say. Okay. El Gordo. 
when it's premium furniture you're looking for. I could watch this. I could watch this guy forever. Everyone's playing in the sand pits in the general chat. Yeah, they're just posting different faces. They're just not. There's not anything here happening. There's. It's just faces for. For how long? How long is this? How many fucking faces are happening in this hit? The mark of. I'm not looking at the Discord again. I'm not looking at the Discord ever again. Scroll down. I'm not looking. <laughs> Record scratch. So, I guess you're wondering, what brought me here? Why am I here in the car? Jesse, watch out. I see dots. Okay. I... This is supposed to be a video stream. Like waking up too early. Restoring order and justice to furniture buyers. The edit just posted? What is... Oh, God. All right. All right. That's enough. 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 It's everywhere. The legend of El Gordo lives on in premium crafted furniture. Selected for contemporary style and classic. It was back. Yeah, it was backwards. I didn't understand what was going on, why it was backwards. I have no idea why it was backwards. Elegance and defending your right to the best mattress on the market. El Gordo won't win the sword. Pretty good. I'll see you in the store. I'll see you in the store. Okay, hold on. There's there's actually so many of these I can't believe it, but we have to spend time on other things other than that. Guy. We got we got to spend time on other things other than just that guy. Hold on. Okay. Here's um father and son crosswalk spring break. When you hear crosswalk, what do you think that it's referring to? You think it's like crossing a road, right? Or a street or something? Now, I haven't been a Christian for like a decade and a half. Isn't this the most offensive thing of all time? Isn't this the most offensive thing you could possibly do in your whole fucking life? They put wheels on them? Yeah, and they also padded the inside corner of them so they wouldn't hurt their whittle shoulder. They taped, like, a pillow on the inside of it so that it wouldn't, like, dig into their shoulder too much. Socks at the beach. Socks and shoes on the beach. What are you, crazy? This is really weird. You know, it kind of makes me feel like maybe Jesus didn't suffer that much because he had the wheel. Right? I thought that carrying the cross was pretty hard, but now I'm looking at him like he got the pillow, he got the wheel. Right? Wasn't that hard. You know? Didn't see that. Christianity for sale. Christianity for sale. Ding a ling a ling a ling. Christianity. Imagine getting to the um, pearly gates and you look at St. Peter and St. Peter sees like a video of you doing this. But. He's and, gay. And he just like looks at you. And he's like, what was up with that? And you're like, well, I was trying to. Um, uh, make people Christian. But you're like, that was you shouldn't have done that. That was crazy. Mm. 
Ridiculous. Hey, DBJ. I've been burned too many times by bad edits, okay? I'm not gonna... I am living... I'm... Yeah, I am living like an adult. I am living like an adult. I'm a grown-up. More grown-up than you. Shut up. More grown-up than you are. I'm more grown-up than you. So... Funny you thought you think that, but this one is nice. Okay. Here's here's the next one. It's a video. Oh. Meow. That was cute. That was cute. I have to talk about this. I I, I never talk about other streamers. I have to talk about this clip. This clip is the most insane thing I've ever seen. Making kids? Yeah, I don't freaking know. What my god do go This is Alinity. This is the streamer Alinity. Prison for? Um, my dad was the lawyer of a company called Droga La Rebaja, and everyone that worked there went to prison. Cause uh <laughs> they found that the the cartels was using uh the company to launder money. <laughs> It was like a really big scandal. My parents were on TV and everything. Okay. I feel like I have soap in my vagina. Give me one second. I'm going to go wash it up. Okay. All right. Okay. Go. Okay. <laughs> the whole... It creates a whole, like... It's... Did she take a truth serum? She's talking like she she's took like what sodium dioxide or whatever the fuck. <clears throat> What's so funny about it? It's just talking. It's just her saying that her her father and everyone went to jail because they were because of cartel. And then she said, "I got soap in my vagina." Goodbye. <laughs> Is this what it's like to have adult ADHD? I wonder. I wouldn't know. I do wonder, but that was, but it is very funny. I do wonder. I do wonder. The iron crotch pulls truck. That's not that cool to hit yourself in the stomach with a stick. That's not that impressive. I'm not going to like this, I think. This is something I have the utmost in confidence um, that will be... I have the utmost confidence that this will be a fucking killer, like, video. I think it's going to be really good. I don't know why he keeps doing this. That's just strange. I don't know what he's doing. Okay. So he has tied a bandana around. No, that wasn't him making himself hard. That wasn't that wasn't him making himself hard so that he could find it. That wasn't. It was something else. Well, maybe that's what it was. <laughs> Censoring with a transparent rectangle. That is very funny. That is very funny. All right. Every time... My dad is, like, very distracting when he gets into chat. When he gets into chat... And maybe this is where I get it, but he he just can't help but draw attention. Right? It's very I'm difficult... to For him to not pull attention. Splam, thank you for the nine months. It's insane to do this and not even let us see his penis. If I'm the guy standing around this guy, at least, like, let me see it. You're going to be shy? Thanks for the gifted sub to Ed Clark Music. I'm just like, 
if I show up to see this guy pull a truck with his nuts and then at the at the ninth hour, at the eleventh hour, he's like, Well, oh, I'm gonna cover you know, I don't want anyone to look at it. I don't want anyone to look at it. It's like fuck what did you call me out here for? Uh, go off Kings. Can you imagine trying to jerk this guy off? Ha, ha, my dad is here. He's watching. And you know what he said? You know what he said to me about the go off Kings stream? He said, I don't really get it. Like two times ago when I was on your show and he was what he was like, I'll check it out. He was like, I don't really, I don't know what, what are they doing? And I said, it's like what I do. And he said, it's not really like what you do. I was like, okay. So he doesn't even like you guys. I'm very excited for sh stream. Uh, I'm very excited for stream week. What is it called? Show week? Store week? Store week is going to be good. <laughs> New theme week. I'm streaming this week. <laughs> I'm doing a week of th of streams themed around streaming. Oh my god. Wow. Why is that? I don't like this is this feels like insult to injury making all the guys with spears stand in the fucking truck bed. Is it not impressive to just pull the truck? This is crazy. How many subs to do this? If we hit 5000 subs, I will attempt to do this. If we have 5,000 subs. Pretty good. Okay. Now, unfortunately, I want you, let's just all take this in. Let's all just take in what we're looking at here. Just the title, the first frame of the video, like, I mean, the whole thing is, is just amazing. Th this is beautiful. Okay, sorry about the lag. It's not his crotch. That's not his crotch. He dares he tears his dick off in this one, it rules. That would be a really good Shaolin monk showcase. If you show up and like they're beating on the guy's dick and he's not reacting. <clears throat> but then at the end of the show they just rip it off of him and he still doesn't react. Stop posting these. Just stop posting these. Just knock it off. Just stop it. Just stop. The face is cool. It is. Actually, it is cool. The face actually is really cool. The face I made. And it's hot. It's hot. Two. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> fucking Christ. Fuck! Okay. 
sure to join the Discord. Punch him in the dick. Punch him in the dick. <laughs> he was pulling those kicks. That wasn't that impressive. Hey, if it's still Jill Tail, thank you for these seven months. <laughs> this is really bizarre. This is really bizarre. Oh. He thrusts to flick his balls up over where the kick hits. 420. What kind of hang do you think he has on those things? What if it's cold? What if it's cold in the room? Like, then what? This, I mean, this is basically just magician stuff. This is like being a magician. But let's watch it. This, oh, why is he old now? Oh. troll face <laughs> he's doing a fucking troll face and this guy's hitting himself with a dick with a brick It attracts many practitioners. Oh my god, what is this fucking Ewok trap that they have for their nuts? They got a fucking they got a fucking stormtrooper trap. Oh. Thanks for the gift and sub the game tapes. I guess I don't understand. I guess I don't understand. Let me just pin Hal's message. Maybe it feels good. I... This has to be an alert. I don't know what the fuck alert this has to be. This is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. Add it, add it to the BRB screen is another thing I was thinking as well. Tier 2 sub. I like the tier 2 sub being thanks for your power play. I like that. You ever see that video of like a thousand people playing a Foo Fighters song on guitar at the same time? They should do that but this. And now he's doing his little dance, which is nice. That's good that he did his little dance. That's that's. We're on the way. Oh my God! Rub it up, turtle. Thank you for the ten months. Thank you. 
Thank you. Man with balls of steel to break records. There's something about the title of this channel that po it's the logo is about to pop up. I saw it pop up for a second. The logo is about to pop up. And the, the name of the channel is it, with this footage is so fucking funny. It's so unbelievably funny. I couldn't, I, I didn't even, I can't even react to it. The footage and the title. <laughs> like that's i mean that's uh, that's unbelievable that's that's i can't even i don't even know what to, i can't that's crazy interesting india it's cbt week that's definitely a fake sledgehammer. It's a brick, and they broke the brick in half. Okay. There's a bunch of motorcycles trying to pull his... Whoa! He's trying to pull his arms off. That last one didn't seem like a world record. That last one didn't. That last one just sounded seemed like someone jumped on him. That last one didn't seem like a world record to me. That didn't seem. He's he's stepping all over the trees. It's a world record. It's a world record. I could do the fucking bottle. The bottles thing is not that hard. Put breaking. You couldn't do it. You could. You don't think I could break bottles against brick? It's a bottle. You don't think I could break bottles with? It's against a brick. Not a chance. Everyone's begging for bottle week and bottle stream. What is bottle week? It's a, people who are saying bottle week. What do you think the second stream of that would be? The first stream would be 20 minutes long and 15 minutes would be build up. What would the second do it again? More bottles. You figure it out. It's your idea. It's not my idea. What do you mean you figure it out? It's your fuck. It's your week. No, it's not. You could break a mirror by looking at it. driving over his ass and dick why even tell us about bottle week if you don't have an idea just shut the hell up just shut the hell up now this guy got some strong nuts okay <laughs> I right, this one i like this I actually like this one. I actually I actually like this one. Okay. I actually like this one a lot actually. So this one we can interesting India. Interesting India. Okay. Uh This video on the right that says man's big balls hanging out of his shorts is so It's so hard for me not to click on. I want to click on it so bad. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> oh, my voice is I, my voice is shot. Also, me watching the stream. I'm gonna fucking kill every person in chat right now. I swear to God, I'm gonna kill everyone. I'm gonna kill everyone. Why 
is his head so small? It's gonna be a bloodbath. Okay, so this one is not a, actually that interesting of, of a video, <clears throat> but there's actually an interesting audio quirk to this video, and we'll see if you guys can pick up. It's kind of hard to, once you notice it, it's, you can't unsee it, right? It's one of those, but let's see if you can pick up on the interesting audio quirk of this video. Give us a hint. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, it's really funny. <laughs> Why would you Mark. not just why would you post this? Why 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 would you post this? This is a honey close the door clip. Mm -hmm. Hey, Ronania, thanks for the nine months. Colin, thanks for the gifted sub to could not hear you. Thank you so much. Are they hitting chip bags? This is what it sounds like when you hit those old sun chip bags that were biodegradable. <laughs> this, is, this is what those fucking sun chip bags sound like. Hey, Fish Tank Tango, thanks for the two months. Practitioners tend to have enlarged palms. I don't think that's true. I don't think that's true. Okay, we're we've listened to that enough. Uh, we will return to this later. Somebody submitted both of these videos. Which are just hold on. Hey, thanks for the gift. It's up to CBT enthusiast. Thank you. It's in 4K. It's in 480. But I'll also say uh, that the funniest part about this is actually the description, uh, which is video material about the Tara 4x4 vehicle, Serbia. Sorry, the video material is a bit bad. Yeah. Yeah, it's not good. It's not good. And then somebody also... Oh! Somebody also submitted this. This is like a Dragon Ball vehicle. It's a vehicle they would have in Dragon Ball. It is cool. It is fucking pretty cool. What the fuck? It can do this? You do this? Whoa! Oh! That's insane. That's fucking crazy. How often do you need to do that? All the time. Do you have two wheels or what is? God damn. God damn, this is cool. I don't like this one. I like this one. This, one. this is the one I like. This is the one I like. It has four wheels. It has, it has four wheels drive. Um, Hold on. Let me see where we're going from here. Uh, where do we go? Here's a short one. Man caught secretly being a fan. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. I like that. <laughs> He's so embarrassed. 
Masculinity is a prison. Nope. I live in ancient. I'm ancient. I'm Rome. I'm a Rome. But. I'm ancient Rome. I'm like Marcus Aurelius. I'm like Marcus Aurelius. So it's Chad. I'm a warrior. I'm manning the ballista, just like in my map games. I'm just like the I'm just like the small characters that man the ballista in my map games. Come with me to take a shit at the Crystal Castle in Byron Bay. I know it sounds like a visiting a large meth lab but no it's actually right. a really rich person's farm so many people have told me to come and check out the box here did i expect the entry fee to be 50 dollars? no did the crystals here heal my soul as australia's number one artist and poet no 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 but they look pretty sick there are lots of rocks here and people talking about enlightenment and stuff really love that for them live your truth just don't turn your truth into an mlm thanking you now for the toilets pretty stand i just i just don't like this editing style i don't think i can take it you know like i i like a lot about this but there's something about the 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 style where it's just it can't stop cutting and it's got to be like 18 one-liners instead of being like an actual script for a video it has to be 18 one-liners in a row it, it's i don't know standard setup here nothing special bog roll was giving a mosquito net texture hand wash smelt like sandalwood and citrus but the real showstopper was the sink the bog itself is average mate but the sink the sink does look crazy. Is the voice of a generation. Now I suggest you make the whole bathroom like the sink. Just a cheeky thought. <laughs> Where's next on my shit list? Pretty good. Um, somebody said I I only like I don't I don't like fifteen year olds or this is for fifteen year olds. If you think this is for for fifteen year olds, you don't have. Hold on, let me check. <clears throat> Dad, are you still in the chat? Let's just, I just need to make, I just need to, just need to see, <clears throat> just a quick yes or no. Is Ed Clark in the chat? No, he's not. Okay. Everyone who's saying this is for 15 year olds does not have a 60 year old father with ADHD and it shows. And so many of your dad, so many of your dads and moms have ADHD and they don't know what that is, but they definitely have it worse than you have it, right? It's not a young person thing. It's absolutely not a young person thing. The reason that all of your parents are fucking insane is because they're on Facebook and Facebook is the thing that's like tweaking all of their actions so that they're perfectly aligned to buy like fucking t-shirts that say Trump train, get on or get run over. Like that's it's just a different kind of psychosis. It's a different brand. It's all the same fucking like neurons inside of your brain. It does, so saying that this is like 15 year old zoomer shit, it's like, not really, not really. And if they stop using the internet for a couple of days, then they'll be normal. <clears throat> all right. <sighs> Now it just feels like you guys want attention. Now it just feels like everyone just wants attention. They just want to be on the stream for a second. They just want attention. That's just what it feels like. It feels like everyone just wants attention. This one is... It's okay. Hold on. Where was I? This is... Uh, don't say that. The shocking history behind 10 idiom sayings you probably used before. Based on who submitted this, I think this might be AI slop. And welcome back to Divine Intervention Channel. Today we're diving into the dark side of language that might make you think twice about what you say. I think, yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. One. Kick the bucket. This one might seem harmless, but it actually refers to a method of execution. In the 18th and 19th centuries, criminals were sometimes hanged with a rope looped over a horizontal bar. Okay. If they struggled enough, they could potentially kick the bucket away, 
causing them to fall and die by strangulation. They made him stand on a bucket? Yikes! Two, cost an arm and- <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Yikes! That's a method of execution that makes me go, Dame on a And a leg. This phrase implies something is incredibly expensive. This, this, method, this ancient method of execution will make you say, Yummy, Ro! But where did it come from? Well, throughout history... Who the fuck is Ass Lady? What the... Ass Bot? Ass Bot showed up. Something is incredibly expensive. From... Well, throughout history, losing limbs in war or accidents was a common occurrence. Soldiers who lost limbs were often left disabled and unable to work. Didn't we... You guys just intuitively know what cost an arm and a leg means, right? It means that it costs something dear. Like, that's just... That one's intuitive. That's not like a... Fuck. It's not like it... Uh, it, need, it doesn't need a story. Butson, thank you for the ass lady. Making them incredibly poor. So, saying something cost an arm and a leg meant it was more valuable than someone's ability to work and support themselves. You're thinking, Three, you're overthinking throw someone it. under the bus. Back in Roman times, criminals were sometimes executed by being thrown to wild animals, often lions. No. <laughs> no, no, that's not, that's not, no, that's not why. That's not why, the bus was a different, the bus is a different thing. Four. What, you didn't even mention a car? You're like, you got fed of animal? <laughs> you just ended at lions? That's just a Roman lion bus? Go the extra mile. All the lions are on the bang bus running my ass over for stealing a fucking ear of corn from the market. This means putting in extra effort. It comes from a Roman military tradition. What? Go the extra mile. This means putting in extra effort. Okay. It comes from a Roman military tradition. Roman soldiers were expected to march about 20 miles a day. Why is it? Why is it Roman also? Why is it also Roman? But sometimes, in emergencies, they might be required... Results. Effort, 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 results. ...to march an extra mile to reach their destination faster. Five. Spill the beans. This means revealing a secret. Yeah, but where do the beans come from? In ancient Greece... It's not well. It's not Rome. It's not Rome, but <laughs> but it is the same thing. It's it's. <laughs> but where do the beans come from? In ancient Greece, ancient Rome, Greece. Also, I don't mean. I'm not trying to be rude. I just think it is fun. A little funny, just how it's lit in this scene, of stock footage. But this looks like one of those spot the main character images from anime. Like, like the one brightly lit, like 100% pale, like blue haired person. <laughs> like kind of crazy. Like it also, it looks like that's the only character that you can control in the scene and everyone else is pre-rendered. White beans were used in voting. Voters would cast a white bean for yes. No, they would not cast a white bean for yes. What? Yes, and a black bean for no. What? What are you fucking stupid? If someone spilled the beans, it meant they accidentally revealed how everyone voted, which could be a big deal. They didn't vote with a white bean. Six, left high and dry. This seemingly harmless phrase originates from a brutal punishment. How would that reveal anything? You'd get a sense. You get a sense of. Been at sea. Say it means someone literally spilled beans, which are a pain to clean. Yeah, it's it's let the cat out of the bag, or that sort of thing, where it's like you're releasing something that you shouldn't release, right? You're spilling something that you shouldn't spill. Sailors caught committing crimes were sometimes abandoned on a small deserted island with no food or water. You're just making them shit to up. Face a slow and agonizing death. You're just making shit up. Seven, dead ringer. We use this for someone who looks exactly like another person, but its dark origin lies in body snatching.
body snatching. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. In the 18th and 19th centuries, medical schools needed bodies for dissection. Grave robbers might steal a corpse and replace it with a dead ringer, a fake body made of wood or rags, to avoid detection. Eight. How would that help? How would... How would that help? If they replace... Let's say they dig... Hold on. Let's say they dig up a body, right? Let's follow this up. Let's say they dig up a body and steal it and sell it for organs or whatever. And then they bury the casket back. Why would it, it being a wooden body fool them? Because if somebody digs that person up to check, they're not going to, like, see the wooden body and then put him back, like, not check beyond that. They're going to notice it's wood. Right? They're going to notice it was, like, wood. If they went to that trouble, what is, okay, what does this say? Yeah. Ringer was a 19th century term for a duplicate. And then dead is just, like, it's, like, English slang for, like, exactly. That's insane. Not if they were a dummy. Go down in flames. We use this for a spectacular failure, but it has a literal and terrifying origin. This phrase evokes the image of a burning aircraft crashing, a dramatic and often fatal event. Yep. Nine. Okay, well, that one didn't even have an explanation. That one was just, that one was just, that's, it's what you would expect. T nine was like, nine, duh. <laughs> Nine, duh. <laughs> Who's fucking formatting these things? Nine, the. The light at the end of the tunnel. This offers hope in difficult times. Yet, its origin could be linked to miners Nine, working in dark, dangerous tunnels. The sight of light at the end could have signaled either escape or a potential collapse. Ten, go off the deep end. Today, it describes losing control emotionally. Mm -hmm. However... Its origin lies in nautical disasters. Sailors who fell overboard or whose ships... This is, this is the most chat GPT bullshit I've ever seen in my entire life. It's all just like exactly what chat GPT would do where it, it just hung on to whatever the first fucking Tumblr post it found that said something. And just Sank. say, that's probably what it was. We're said to have gone off the deep end, facing a watery grave. So, there you have it. Language is fascinating, isn't it? If you enjoyed not, this, not really. let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like. Sh Divine Intervention Corner. I don't know that I can deal with this. I don't I don't know that I can deal with this. I don't know that I can deal with it. Hold on. I need to I need to check something. Um Hold on. Make your banana pancakes. Pretend it's that it's Smith. the weekend. Uh. Yeah, here it is. But I need to. T I I wanted to talk about this also. This is like a mobile game, or something with Will Smith in it. I know what you're thinking. Anybody would kill to have this view. At least that's what I tell myself every day. I mean. Is there something happening to his proportions over time? Like, I feel like he's, like, as he gets more insane, like, he also looks more insane. I mean, every damn day. And no. Head shrinking? Yeah, that's what it feels. It feels like his head is getting smaller. His head was big when it, when it was early. You're not dreaming. Here, you're free to go anywhere. If you want to explore, you can escape into the wilderness. Best of all, you can find peace and quiet under the stars. 
except when 9-11 happens. 9-11 happened. Sorry. Sorry for your vacation. You can't beat a breakfast you cut yourself. You can fry them, grill them, or smoke them if you got them. You got your choice of wheels. Some are more selfie friendly than others. Now this is hot. Sometimes you need a little more horsepower. What is he fucking advertising? Does anybody, has anybody picked up on anything happening in the game? Like, what is, what is he advertising? Undawn? That's what it said. It's a video game, as, but that's outside information that I knew before I started watching. Right? Ah, uh, dope, right? But, um, there is one thing. The neighbors kind of suck. They really suck. They do not respect boundaries. They'll chew you up and won't spit you out. This is strange. We, survivors, have a problem with that. Why would you mention the rest? What was the rest of it for? We are not your dinner. Period. Oh my god. Oh my god, they made him look like like Will Smith from 10 to 15 years ago. They <laughs> they made him look like Will Smith from like 10 15 years ago instead of no Anthony Mackie Smith. Yep. This is he's he's not the cheapest actor you can hire. I think that People are like, this is a Chinese game. Maybe in other countries, they haven't f learned that he's insane yet. Right? Maybe they just haven't picked up on, like, that he's completely fucking deranged yet. This is Will Smith, and I'm waiting for you in Undawn. This is Will Smith. This is Will Smith. and th 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 This is Will Smith. And uh, I want to hang out with you. So call me. Call me. This is Will Smith. Call me. Call me. I'm running two of my... I'm sorry. It's so loud. Everything's so loud today. I'm so sorry. None of this. Six gun in this. Run the run the this. I'm running two of my most powerful fans on high. The 1980s, 60s, Dayton, Lasco. The 16 inch Dayton Lasco. Look at this. Doesn't that seem like it's actually the best fan ever made? Like for like, seriously, doesn't it seem like, like no joke. This is like way better than any fan that you could commercially buy. And the 2003, the speed buttons don't even get me started on the tasteful speed buttons. This old kind of weird gray Brown colorway is to me it's gorgeous can i show you something let me let me show you what look at look at the keyboard that i selected i love this keyboard you know you know i love that shit i love i love that weird old brown color and it's loud as hell let's go in the 2003 that's the Cyclone Pedestal fan. It's like I do like old stuff. What switches? They're browns, but they're not like, they're not the, the uh, regular browns. They're like off-brand browns, but they're good. I like old stuff. Don't come here unless you like old stuff. Don't come if you're a frat. Don't come. I didn't expect frats to come at all. Now it's all frats. A cyclone in here. Woohoo! <laughs> and also down here, we got the 2001 Lasco Premium Box Fan 3723. Whoa! How is he standing? How is he still standing up? All running on high. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> All running on high. Ha <laughs> ha! Maybe he is floating. Let's go 
Premium Box Fan 3723. All running on high. Ha <laughs> ha. Also, DBJ, today is Elton John's birthday. Happy birthday to Elton John, one of the realists to ever do it. Seriously, one of the best to ever do it. And uh, a favorite musician of mine, and I love him so much. Um, you just love to see and he's and he is dill dandin he's dill dandin back up at the piss end of his life thank you so much for the four gifteds rally thank you uh So I, so I picked this up. I've been looking for one for months. From work, um, I work in a janitorial, as a janitorial worker in an office. It's so funny when the fan starts blowing on him and you just hear the air noise. That's so good that he's not, he's just standing directly in the floor. Cause he's not, it's not like he doesn't want to get blown by the fan, you know? Office building. Where they have a bunch of these old oscillating 16 inch table fans. Is there a fans community like the fire alarms? Looks like it. Made by Dayton. Well, they've been getting it rid cer- of a lot certainly of these seems old fans like as well. And so they, because I put a word out saying I collect vintage fans. And I like old vintage fans. And they're like, well, if we come across one that we're, we want to get rid of, we'll give it to you. And so I ended up with this one. It was Monday. It was Monday that I and um, I was offered this fan and Monday. I took it and I it, I accepted it. So um, these are getting harder. These 16 inch table fans are hard, getting harder to find. Whether it be the last cool galaxy versions, I actually want this fan so bad. I want I want it so bad. Um, the Air King versions. I mean, the Air King version is still being sold. The last Gold Galaxy versions from the 1990s and early 2000s are getting really hard to find. So when you pick one up with the, when you do find one of these, pick it up if it does run. Um, yes. Because they're getting harder to find. They're very strong fans, and I love them a lot. And I highly encourage someone to buy one of these. But DBJ, don't you already have the best fans in the world? I almost forgot. But that's every time I almost forget, that's when you guys show up. Pussy for me. The chip enjoyer. We hate your guts. Following since July sixth. Let's let's just check this guy out. Okay. Let's let's just check him out. Just just to you know just to make sure that he's okay. You know just to make sure he's okay. Okay. Seems to be supportive of the topics, uh, like that I'm talking about. Seems to be adding to the conversation, talking about what's happening on screen. That's nice. Um, let's see. Loves typing stream over about halfway through when the stream is supposed to be over. So not super supportive. Hmm. Let's see. This person is not that. Hey, thanks for the gift. It's up the chip enjoyer. Hmm. Honestly. I can't even, I can't really characterize this because the chip enjoyer is saying too many, like, sentence fragments. Does that make sense? Way too many sentence fragments for me to characterize. Here's a bunch of consecutive messages. I do. Nothing. Cuneiform. Cunty. Close it up. Say. Oh, fine. Deviant G. Way off. Can we not? I think that the chip enjoyer thinks that they're having a personal conversation with me. 
I think that I think that they they believe that they are talk like we're having a back and forth. I think that's what that's and of course he said yes. Okay. Mitch on Doughboy says ookie cookie a lot and I hate it. <laughs> that's what it's called. It's called ookie cookie. I scrolled up too far and I saw a message that said fat PFT and first I don't have the mustache right now but who could you have been talking about who could you have been talking about I love Paul F. Tompkins he has also been cherubic in his life so it's crazy to be like you're the swollen version of him I don't know I don't know I don't know We love a fat-faced lady. That is crazy. When was that sent? That was on the 11th? That was two Mondays ago? We love a fat-faced lady. What the fuck is that? That's insane. I don't even know. And then one minute later, you sent birth of smell. Just the, me the whole message is birth of smell. What the fuck is that? What could that possibly mean? That's scary. That's really scary. Birth of smell. I don't I don't know about this. Okay. Yeah, a lot a lot of three word messages. Okay. You know what? I apologize. Chip enjoyer. You were not you're bad. I'm sorry. You were bad. I'm sorry. You lose. Bad. Sorry. Sorry. You were bad this time. I'm, I'm so sorry. Also, I got to pee. I'll be back in 60 seconds. Oh, why is it still this fucking thing? This is... I don't want this fucking thing. This is... I hate this fucking thing. Hold on. Where's the real BRB screen? Let us watch it. It sucks. Look how bad it sucks. Check this out. This shit fucking sucks so bad. Fuck. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, 60 seconds. Be right back. Like Superman trainer, hey. real, real rare. Like Super Saiyan Mega, I jump, stomp, stomp on Lucifer Sage. Now I got a few rings on Jupiter skating. I meant to say Saturn, switched up the pattern. Smoking on some shatter, got me higher than a ladder. Thanks, I'm flatter. My baby mama batter. You look like Mick Jagger. Oops, a grease splatter. Hot, hot, Ooh. jumping out the grease. It's a whole lot of degrees. About to come about. People are on thin fucking ice. You guys are on fucking thin ice. Looking at selfies on stream. ENS, that is actually such a funny, just conceptual idea. Just, just imagining a streamer doing a selfie review. Where they're, they're like reviewing pictures of that they took of themselves. It's like the most Ouroboros idea of all time it's yeah it's like grim it's like scary it's like what the this is meaningless this doesn't even this is nothing i don't even know what this means this one is this one is crazy um there was also this one which this one is good Th this one is good i do like that one yeah oh turn off chat audit and let's let's try to find where I even was in the stream. I've totally forgotten where I even was in the stream. Oh, I have to watch this. This is so funny. This one is so funny. I really 
I don't know Jennifer Garner well enough to know if this is a joke on purpose or not. Somebody should tell me. I think it, it's so crazy that I'm like, it, it kind of has to be. But this is her wishing Reese Witherspoon a happy birthday with smooth jazz. <laughs> like this is <laughs> I know everyone's listen I know people are saying like I it's a joke what about the imagine video during COVID. What about the Imagine video? Every time I think that the celebrity is, I am trying to give them the benefit of the doubt. I'm like, they did the fucking Imagine video. They don't know what's happening. They don't know what the real world, they don't know what the world is like. You've done a lot of stupid, corny horse shit too. Name one thing. And do it in the offline chat so it doesn't distract me when it's real and hurtful. Anyway, I I will assume that it's that's a joke. It's really good. Uh, let's see. Hold on, I gotta move on. Psh. Okay, I'm actually gonna leave it up to a vote. We have an hour left, and the next thing that we pick will probably take up. Well, it might not, but let's, let's hear a vote. Okay. Hear, hear a vote for what the next thing we watch is. Okay. Don't vote before. Don't type until I give you both options. Okay. Number one is Cutlery Corner. Watch porn with me. Thank you. Number one is Cutlery Corner clips and bloopers. Number two is meatball. Okay? Now vote. I'm sick of Cutlery Corner. We watched it for like an hour on Thursday. Okay, everyone's saying meatball. And you know what? I think so. I think that that is the correct choice. This is meatball broke into my beer fridge. Yeah. Well, 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 who do we have here? Well, what'd you do wrong today, Meatball? You broke into my beer fridge. We're not doing this for an hour. I'm just, what is the next thing? Because I wanted to do a segment, and either the segment was going to be Cutlery Corner segment or Meatball segment. Huh? Huh? I told you I was making beef jerky. <laughs> There's something every every little detail of this guy and his and his and his relationship to this creature is so perfect. I told you, I told you, time and time again, you betray me, Meatball. That meat that was marinating in the bowl was for beef jerky. <laughs> Wait, what is this? This is unrelated. I don't know why you sent me this. It does look fucking good. It is. This is just a meatball sub, right? This is just three meatball subs. Yeah, it looks good. Why are you just sending? Why are you sending me that? Okay, let's get back to it. I don't know. DBJ, I think you're in that photo. You have me so anxious. You have me so anxious and on edge. I'm like, the face is in there. I'm like, I'm like, the face is in there. Like at this point of the stream, I'm like, somebody is that why it got clipped? I I found it? It's not in there. It's no, you're lying. It's not in there. You're not parsley upper right. No, it's not. There's no, it's not, it's not in there. 
It actually is. You people, can he not see it? Don't fuck with me. Do not fuck. Seriously, do not fuck with me. Do not fuck with me. This is cheese lower left. You are. I'm actually going to lose my mind. The face, the fucking DreamWorks face. The clock face is not in here. Clock face is not in this image. I know clock face is not in this image. You're not going to fuck with me. But, but, P-Man, thanks for the 10 months. I know it's not it. I'm just going to click away. It's not, it's not, it's not in there. It's not in there. It's not in there. It's not, it's not in there. It's not in there. It's not in there. You got in the, don't you, look at me. You know you got in my beer fridge. You opened it up. <laughs> you ate all the beef jerky. <laughs> got my beer fridge I pointed out the face in the pic for this is a different picture this is a different picture for sure I know this is a different picture it was raw beef jerky you ate all the raw beef jerky marinated beef jerky that I was making. Yeah. You don't even care, do you? Every video is of him scolding this dog. Just videoing and scolding the dog. It's so funny. Like, because I know that nothing's going to change. I know the dog is going to keep acting up. And I know the guy is going to keep getting mad at him and doing nothing. To be fair, the dog is drunk. The dog is drunk. The dog is that kind of drunk. We're on the way. It's the kind of drunk where like, you're like wondering if you could just fall asleep on your friend's couch and would they get mad at you? Right? Like you don't want to Uber back to your house. You want to fall asleep on your friend's couch and you're like, can everybody leave my friend's living room so I can sleep in my friend's living room? <laughs> All right, another Discord link. I've put Jesse in this image, but where? No. I'm not in here. I, I know I'm not in here. You wouldn't have done that. You wouldn't have done that. You wouldn't have put me in here. Parsley top right. <laughs> Parsley top right. I was going to ask one of my mods if they could, like, see if, it, if I'm actually in here. But I, I don't trust my mods. I don't trust my mods to do that. We gotta move. We just keep watching. We gotta watch Weepall, okay? You could care less. That was beef jerky. I I'm, I'm tired today. I'm like sleep. I'm like very tired, and I'm having a hard time keeping my hands on the wheel of the stream. I hope it's. I hope it's not too too terribly obvious. But I really feel like, like the rud the stream is rudderless. It's it doesn't have the rudder that it usually has. Yeah, right, dude. Thank you for the nine months. And Sai, thanks for the ten. I was making for the week. It was... T <laughs> Ernest Moan's stream still good? I know it's... Listen, I don't actually think it's bad. I'm just like, I gotta, I gotta make sure that I don't... Here's the main thing. I gotta make sure that I don't spend the next 45 minutes looking at the Where's Waldo image. Okay? That's what I... That's what I mean. That's... That's the main thing. Found you in the Waldo pick. This, I'm not in, even in these. <laughs> I'm not in the meatball sub. This is not even me. This is the meatballs. From, from the other image. Check the parsley. 
I'm not in the parsley! That was three pounds of beef jerky that you stole from me. Is there a way, I just had this thought, is there a way that we could, there's not a lot of images. If you like search Jesse Clark or Dead Blossom Jesse on, I don't actually know what would come up on Google if if you searched. I don't think it would be a lot of pictures of me. Um, is there a way, because we kind of have a blank slate. First result is your Facebook. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, is there a way we could see, like, seed a bunch of images of me? Because there's not a lot of images of me out there that are, like, incorrect. Right? Like, a lot, like, just make a bunch of different pictures of me with my eyes, like, 20% too small and close together. <laughs> and... And just send those out. So that's like the only images that are out from me is, is like, is that Tom Walker, Tom Walker. Did Tom do this? Did Tom do this exact bit? He better not have. It's a good joke. Well, maybe two pounds. I know you don't care. I know you could care less. Now you, all right, well. I guess you're not even going to feel guilty or anything. All right, we're going back to bed. Shh. That's Meatball. We got more Meatball going on. Meatball and his dog the tricks. The time of the day is for Meatball to do one trick for me. Can you do a trick? Can you do a trick? Can you see it? To go, well, can you let... Well, you did it before I told you to do it, moron. Can, um... <laughs> can you stand what year is this from this is from three years ago can you stand up can you stand up here's something that came up with hold on let's finish this are you kidding me meatball's cute I like meatball hold on we'll, we'll get to this in a sec huh Huh? What? This, what? A Jesse Clark mystery. Death by reunion. Lots of fun. A great mystery. <laughs> Amazon review. No, this was written by Helen Goltz. Jesse Clark's 10-year school reunion boasted a few shocks, and that didn't include Jesse running a publicly publicity and private investigator business. It's crazy. Jesse Clark cozy mysteries. Also, Jesse Clark is spelled differently in each of these titles. Wait, Jesse Clark is a... Is a girl? That's not how Jesse is spelled when you're a girl. It's J-E-S-S-I-E. -S 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 That's the... <laughs> Featuring sassy Jesse Clark, her handsome boyfriend, Dominic. I don't have a handsome boyfriend, Dominic. I don't even know Dominic. Show Dominic right now? I don't know Dominic. He's not, we're not close to each other. Now this is, this is not me. I just want to make clear, this is not me. This is not me. Don't say, stop saying rest, stop. Stop saying rest in peace. I'm alive. Stop. Hey, I'm alive. I'm alive. Hey. Hello? Can anybody hear me? I'm alive. You call this living?
baby. Meatball is a genius. Cock. You want to come in? He's gay. Would a depressed person do this? It's been a long day without you, my friend. And I'll see you all about it when I see you again. And I'll see you again. It's been a long road to get back again. And I'll na no kneel you all about it when I see you all again. <laughs> Make your banana pancakes, pretend that it's the weekend. <laughs> I can almost still hear their beautiful singing voice. Inside now, hun. You want to go inside, oh. meatball? You want to come inside? You want to come inside? I actually can sing. I actually can sing. Over there, over there. Send the word, send the word to beware that the Yanks are coming. I don't even like. I don't even like meatball subs. I don't think meatball subs is a good food. I don't even like. Parsley top right. This bit is so confusing. You know as much about this bit as I do. I'm telling you. You know as much. I'm looking for any angle on this meatball sub bit also. Okay. We're both looking for any fucking handle on this bit <laughs> we're that's we're all searching for it as a collective chat we're searching for a handle on the meatball sub joke oh good lord you want to go inside buddy you come inside now it's getting pretty windy out here oh man he's like in the chair uh, you're just gonna lick your chair <laughs> What are you? Cl you're cleaning. Your, that's genius. You're cleaning. You're licking the chair and cleaning your face, even though I just gave you a bath yesterday. Jeez. This is crazy. Holy shit! Meatball is so smart. All right, dude. You want to come in? He's so. You're a fucking genius. Smart. Meatball is a genius. How are you gonna clean the other side of your face, though, buddy? Meatball is a genius. Huh? He's are rude to this me? dog. Really Dogs don't speak English. You can be I as rude to you, a dog meatball. as you want. You great big behemoth looking monster. All right, you ready? You get your... Come on. Come on, let's go. Come on, buddy. Let's go inside. I'm coming back in 10 minutes, and you will be inside this house. Well, here we go. This must be trouble for him because here's the thing as much as he wants to be in charge of meatball i don't think this guy behind the camera can physically lift this a creature i don't think that he could physically lift meatball so true so at the end of the day he can't do anything to meatball he can't he can't do anything that he wants i'm coming back in 10 minutes and you will be inside this house well, never mind. I guess you're out here with Fergie. Listen, fat man, I want you in this house. <laughs> All right, then just stay out here and click. That's a follow alert. That's a follow alert, okay? <laughs> That's a follow alert, if I've ever heard one in my life. Listen, fat man, I want you in this house. I want you in this house, fat man. I'm not Joe is hungry. Clean your face. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is a meatball killing machine. Uh, meatball. Meatball. Can you wag your tail? 
I wish I could lay like this. I really wish I could lay like this. This looks so comfortable and awesome. It looks amazing. Meatball. Meatball. You could? Bless you. I can't fold my arms into me like that. I can't fold my arms into me like that. I can't do that. Oh. Are you about to pounce? Somebody's at the front door. Somebody's breaking Meatball. in the front door. Thanks for the gifted sub. Meatball. Somebody's gonna get us. Somebody's coming in the front door. Somebody's gonna come in the front door. He's wagging his tail. All right. He really don't care. He, he's, wa he's wagging his tail. He likes that somebody's gonna come in the front door. Oh, somebody's coming in the front door. Meatball. Meatball. Very good. Meatball. 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 Come on now, right. Meatball. Come on now. He. Oh, oh wait. He's moving. Uh, are you gonna get him? Somebody's coming in the front door. Somebody's coming in the front door. We've got a. Oh, we've got a prowler. Somebody's coming in the front door. But meatball kill. Look at the. <laughs> Sorry, we haven't had a butt in two hours, and that was really funny to me. I'm resetting. Okay. Size his triceps. Meatball kill him. Meatball but. kill. Blah. Wait, Ra Randy, haven't you been gone for like a hundred hours? How long? Wait, I'm realizing Randy's been gone. Isn't that, hasn't Randy been gone a few weeks? You motherfucker. All right, you think you slick. <laughs> I've noticed when you're gone. And that goes for all of you. If you, well, you have to show back up, and then I'm like, I haven't seen that name in a while. I'm not going to notice if you, if you leave, I'm not going to be like, every stream, I'm going to be like, where's this person? But if you come back after a while, I'm going to be like, you haven't been here. You haven't been here. All right, Meatball, there's somebody in the front door. Meatball, somebody's oh, here. Oh, yay! Hi, butts. Meatball? Meatball? Oh. All right. All right, never mind. I like Meatball a lot. I, I like Meatball an awful wait, lot. Wait a minute. Wait just a second. Somebody's on the way. Thanks for the five months. Somebody is about to die. Get him, Meatball. Kill. Kill. Also, I want to say something positive. Um, on the way. Meatball is clearly less heavy in this one than he was in the other one, which was from three years ago, and this is from two years ago. So that's nice. That's positive. Good job, Meatball. Good job, Meatball. Good, good on you, Meatball. Hold on. Let me close the 90 fucking memes of my own face that I have up that are cluttering my screen and making me incapable of streaming okay here's a tiktok i added being alive to every block in minecraft okay that's a crazy way to say what you did that's insane that's crazy why would you say it like that that's like a crazy way to say that on the way. i added being alive to every what added being alive how about i made every Block in Minecraft Alive, or something like that. Hey, Hulkamaniac Depression, thank you for the eight months, thank you. And Old Nick, thanks for the eight months. If you're confused by what this means, you can clearly see every block is now a living, breathing thing. This means that instead of mining, you'll just have to beat every block in a fight. You'll notice that some blocks will drop with their arms and legs still attached, which will stay true for any blocks that you craft. Why? Why did, why did, why did you do, why did you do that? And also for tools made out of these blocks. If you drop one of these tools by accident, it'll run away from you. <laughs> this video made me yawn, bro. I, so first off, I just want to make sure that this is amazing. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Second off, I don't know if it's me growing up and, like, spending so many 
nights when I was like 19 or something. Um, like falling asleep to Yogg's cast Minecraft videos like that. Certain Minecraft things just trigger a peace response, a safety response in my brain. Like whether that's happening, the music in Minecraft is also just peaceful. I don't really know, but definitely Minecraft will just make you yawn, which is not a, a dig. But this is nowhere near as inconvenient as how loud furnaces scream when you smelt their insides or how beds. <laughs> run away from you. If you want to stop blocks from attacking you, you can shear off their arms. And if you want them to st huh? stop running away, you can shear off their legs too. What? But they're still alive! It doesn't mean that they're dead! It doesn't mean they're dead! It doesn't mean they're dead! You can combine four sheared limbs to get a regular full block, but I bet you didn't even consider that these blocks now need wheelchairs to move around. And if you took their arms too, what are you talking about? They'll need someone else to push them. What are you talking about with a brick? That's pretty sick and twisted of you. I'm let. What is with the fucking fucking wood block that's holding it up like it with his little arms? You. I'm letting you shear moblins. <laughs> Next time, so like and follow. Ah! Fingies YouTube. Fingies. Fingy YouTube. I the add the fucking wheelchair bet. Hold on, I need to check something. Hold on. I need to see if he has any anything else insane. I, I need to see if he has anything fucking insane. Fingy's YouTube. He's actually pretty popular. I improved Minecraft's doors. I am- Okay. I think that this guy might actually just fucking kick ass. I think he might actually kick ass. Cause like, look at this. I improved Minecraft's doors. Like that's amazing. That's amazing. As an opening to a video, that's incredible. If two people open a door at the same time, the door will get stuck halfway. This is actually a cool building technique for diagonal builds. And you can make them look more modern with these new glass doors as well. Pretty cool. If you right-click a glass door with a sponge, you can clean off the glass stripes. This makes it easy to walk into them by accident and to make matters- <laughs> Oh god. Can I- I know- maybe I'm a loser. This is like- this makes me feel like it's nine years ago. Because I'm like looking at Minecraft mods and I'm like, that's so cool that the glass doesn't have the streaks on it. Like, like that's, that's where my head is at. Matters worse. I also gave you a new nose. So oh, man, I do. I, nobody else wants to do it. I have been wanting to get a Minecraft goo crew server up for a while and nobody wants to do so it. That you have something to break. Okay. Why would you? These glass doors are very fancy. It would be bad. It, but... would, not, it would not be bad. I'm telling you. It would not be bad. It would actually be good for stream. So I added this doorman to look after them. You can open up all the doors on. Jake and Rocky want to do Minecraft. Let us in. Okay. Um, it's too damn many of you. Let's just be honest. The NS. Okay. Love the show. Love being on it. I, th I think that you guys are pushing the format forward. All right. S we're going to start using numbers. Okay. So, Chris can be one. Jake is Jake, or Jake, maybe Jake's one. And then Chris can be two. Chris is four. Well, that feels cruel, right? 
I feel like Chris's feelings are very fragile. So I'm trying to pull Chris up in the count so that he doesn't feel hurt because he can't take it, right? He can't take it. So put, so Rocky can be three. Who's four? I'll be four. On their body. But what's really cool is that if you place down two glass doors, it'll summon two doormen and you can breed them with any raw meat to make half doors. What? What? Although these are admittedly not very useful since you can just jump over them. I'm adding trap doorman next time, so like and follow. I do like this. I actually like this guy. I actually think this guy is cool. I actually like that guy. I think he's cool. Here is FCN FM. FM. God, ass lady. Thanks for your power play. Butson, thank you for your power play. Nine months. Thank you so much. Uh, okay, here's an industrial video. The inner workings of a hay cutter. Here is FCN FM. Chaff cutter machines work by using a set of sharp blades to cut crop material into small pieces, making it easier and more digestible for That's livestock crazy. animals. They are essential tools for livestock farmers, helping to reduce feeding costs while ensuring their animals receive adequate nutrition. Yep, looks safe too. Just leave that flywheel out there. More, yep, yep, just leave it out. Things, Everything's just out. That's good. Made in China. More chaff. Do you think the machine would feel good? I think that... Cutter machines made in China. I think if I was fed in from this, from underneath, I, it would feel good. Going in from the top would hurt, but getting fed in on the belt would, I think that would straighten me out. If you want to know more, please contact us. So this is AI, uh, just in case people don't know what AI looks like. Here is FCN FM. Chaff cutter machines come in different sizes and types quiet. designed to fit various applications. This, one, this, one, this one's a little quiet. Some machines are designed for small-scale farming operations, while quiet. others are designed for large-scale commercial livestock operations. This one's a little quiet. With varying levels of capacity and power. This one's a little more quiet. More things made in China. More chaff cutter machines made in China. If you want to know more, this please one's a contact quiet. us. Okay. Sorry. Let's get... That was that. Let's get into it. Um, I don't know what this is. Look how cool that mob. Harder. Pull it, Jim. <laughs> Pull it, Jim. Come on, Jim. Pull it, Jim. This, for his benefit, he better not clear the tube. If he clears this thing, he's fucked. <sighs> You're in for a wild ride. Oh, Jim, you chucked like it was a fucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> He's it for a while. Damn right. Holy. Holy. I ain't cleared something like that. Dog's age. He could, he could handle it better than you? Yeah. I mean, maybe. I don't... The last time I smoked weed was like six months ago or something it was a long time ago i think I, I think my tolerance might be pretty low nerd i have i got shit to do <laughs> I, i'm busy i'm busy if somebody said hey you're not you can't you don't have the internet for the next two weeks you can't do your job but Honestly, I would still probably keep trying to do my job. But, you know, if somebody said you can't do anything for two weeks, okay, maybe. I, I don't know. I thought the guys who made this stream had to be on something. You can't smoke at night? It gets in my... I don't know. Listen, people are like, it doesn't give you a hangover. It's like, okay, but I, sometimes you just fucking wake up and you're like still cloudy. I feel like I'm an idiot for like 24 hours after I smoke. It just, it doesn't, it doesn't help. It's really tough. I get real dumb the next day. 
That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying I can I can never do it ever again. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, like you know. It's just not really worth it. I don't know. It's not worth it for me. It does make you a better driver, right? It's good. You get good at driving. What is this? Your part. Ow. Makes you feel like they're cheating on you. That's just as bad as if they actually are. Because how they're making you feel is the same either way. A system's purpose is what it does. The intentions of their behavior doesn't matter. What matters is the result. So you should treat them as if how they're making you feel is what they intend to do. This is what Christian God does to you when he sees you get horny. This, when he sees you unmarried get horny, Christian God looks down and he's like, that's the same. That's the same as if you did it, you prick. I'm fucking getting your ass. And then he fucking smites you with a lightning bolt. Then your personality's different forever. Then you're the devil. Pope said sexual pleasure is good, actually. That's like a new thing. Um, that's a new thing that Christ, like Christians are trying to get off. Is um, they're, they're trying to get it off the ground. Minister, I don't know what is wrong with ministers and the Pope and everything, but they're all trying to say, like, you need to fuck your wife like really good. You need to be like good at fucking your wife and stuff. And like your wife, like you need it needs and it's really good to fuck. Like they're trying to like make it cool. I don't know. It's, it's odd. I don't like hearing you say that. I'm not the one fucking saying it. The Pope did. The only way into heaven is getting your wife off. I mean, hold on. Hold on a second. Oh, where is this fucking thing? This I showed this I I showed this on uh Go Off Kings last week. But this is this is what I was think this is literally what I was thinking of. Yeah. Is is this sort of thing where it's like no, you got to fuck your wife. You you got to fuck your wife really bad. Straight in the belly button? Hold on. Let me see if I can find the other thing that I... Yeah, here, here's the other... Here's, here's another excerpt from this. One problem is that the husband doesn't spend nearly enough time making sure his wife enjoys sex. I always found the old... Interesting, the Old Testament command. When a man has taken a new wife, he shall not go out to war or be charged with any business. He shall be free at home one year and bring happiness to his wife whom he has taken. Now, I am confused by this because the implication seems to be that it used to be that when you went, got married, you could spend a year and, you know, earplugs if you're underage, if you're like a minor earplugs. OK, don't watch the fucking show. But this seems this seems to be like. If you're married, you eat out your wife for a year. <laughs> right. You get a free year to nut and you don't do anything else except. Eat pussy. Right? Isn't it crazy? That feels crazy to me. I don't know. And we don't get that year anymore. Do you get a break? I don't... I don't know. I don't know. This is what's so confusing to me. Did you get divorced after a year? I got pumped and dumped. My ass got pumped and then I, my ass got dumped. I got pumped and dumped. You what the hell? I was like, okay, honey. I was like, okay, honey. My year of my my year of eating your pussy is over. I have to go back to work now. I have to go back to work now. And my wife was like, oh, we gotta talk. <laughs> Gup. Cat swimming in bathtub says gup. Gup. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. I don't know what I expected, but it. Go, go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Bah. laughs> yeah, 
Gabba. That's good. That's very good. Okay. Ooh, it's the singing security man, Tony K. I'm a fuck boy, dirt bag. <laughs> I didn't I didn't know he was gonna spit like that. I didn't know his ass was gonna spit like that. Ow. Piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, the kind your mama warns about when you were a kid. I'm a black hole, lost soul, can't be fixed. There's a reason I keep wrecking relationships and again. I undress, and again, I lose friends, and again, I Has he heard this uh, song? He's reading it off of his iPad. I'm a mess, okay, it's true, and I confess. I, I'm a psychopath, I'm a nice... When it's the... I, one of the things about Tony that you'll learn about him is that his nighttime... When it's the nighttime, he gets way more confident. Um, when it's like, when his videos are filmed at night, he sings a lot louder and more confidently. Are you a Corel B fan? I don't know who that is. Life in your back. It's a shower scene when I'm in the room. I'm a bad attitude. I'm a villain to you. And I would fucking hate me. You've seen Corel on here before? Wait, is he the guy... Is he the guy that just, like, is, he's just in his bedroom, right? And he's on his carpet. And he, and he sings, like, insanely, and he's doing dancing. Okay, yeah, that's the guy. I think I know the guy. This guy. Yep, this is the guy. Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy Buff Crab, baby, back and over the I should, I should have said the guy with the weird painted front of his head. Although I don't really know if that's what that is. I'm confused. I, I really don't know what the idea of the, like the. I don't know. I, I don't really understand. But okay, that was that. Here's this. Steve from Blue's Clues posting this after the Nickelodeon documentary. Checking in. Tell me what's going on. I'm a grown man. You were on the TV 30 years ago. What are you doing? I'm not saying. Full grown adults were crying about this on Twitter. Good Lord. Hey, wake up, wake up, vent to him. Hold on. Hey, I'm checking in. Tell me what's going on. It's just, uh... Some people that I thought were bah. my friends um, asked me to, they saw a funny clock and the fu clock was making a funny face. And they said, they said, you make the face. And I said, I could make the face. And they said, well, the show, prove it. So I made the face. Bah. And, and now they're using it against bah. And I don't think it's very funny. Right. Well, it's good to hear from you. You look great. But... Hey, I'm checking in. Did he shut me down? He cut me off! Pussy. He brushed me off? 
pushed me off. Why would you end that video like that? You would end it like, okay, well, you look good. Okay, well, bye. He's gay. What? Well, it's good to hear from you. You look great. The fuck is that? I just bore my soul. You couldn't even say that suck. It's good to hear from you. What a fucking... I don't know. I don't know. Hold on. New platform will be erected this week. This isn't okay. I was like, "Is this the same alert?" I was, I was like, "The alert must have worn out by now. It must have run out." I love when the stream stops dead for the tuba. The tuba, to be fair, is usually the sound alert we push through the most. But this time, today, I can't. Was it always that long? The problem is today I'm tired, and it has narrowed my attention bandwidth. So now I can't ignore sound alerts or focus on several things. Like, so today sound alerts have totally debilitated me and shut me down. Like, I don't, <laughs> you got to get fiber. You know, I'm going to fuck up that Taco Bell ch cantina chicken menu, which is actually kind of good. <laughs> Steven, you know, you don't get your salmon until you sit down. Actually is pretty good with the cabbage and stuff. Yeah. Too expensive, but good. The soft taco is like two fifty, right? Get like I guess the the burrito is like six bucks or whatever, but um, but I'm just I'm saying if you get two fifty for one Taco Bell taco, I got. I'm sorry. You don't live in the same world that you grew up in. All right. I'm not telling you that it's a better world. I'm saying it's time you started to live in this world. All right? Also, you can still get a stacker, which is like top three menu items of all time at Taco Bell for two fifty, And it's a fucking pound of Taco Bell in one stacker. It's insane. Add jalapenos. You can add jalapenos to any menu item and it will be better at Taco Bell. Any menu item, get add the pickled jalapenos to it, it'll be better. Or just get some pickled jalapenos to have at your house, and they'll be nicer and spicier. That's a good man. <laughs> Taco Bell avoided inflation for years and then did all its catching up at once and quadrupled their prices. I think that's happened to a lot of places. I think that I think a lot of industries um, in suppressed inflation for a long time and then as soon as the floodgates opened they just cranked it up to as much as they possibly could i, th I think that happened to a, a bunch of places that's more or less what happened with the lumber industry that's why lumber is so expensive now is because it was so cheap it was so like undervalued and cheap for so long and now it's just sort of what it's supposed to cost uh, let's sorry let's move on to this <laughs> are you building something Oh, I can't wait. We're building like a big high chair here. Try to teach Steven to come in, sit on my lap. It's weird the way he slapped his, it's weird he, the way he slapped his bare thigh. That's very strange. Lap train the boy. Oh, Steven, one more slice. You slap yours? My legs are too hairy. They wouldn't make that kind of slap. Right? Show us a normal way of doing... No, no. Dude, they're whorfing that shit. How do they eat this like this? Magnificent. Steven and Ethan are going to be mating soon. That's exciting. i to keep you boys hydrated. <laughs> oh. You like the water? You like the water! Steven's looking so clean. Look at him. That's actually really nice. Amazing. He's so white. And look at that meat. 
Yeah. You're in peak form, Stephen. You're looking so healthy and so pretty. Is he even? We. Oui. <laughs> That's nice. I like Stephen. I like Stephen. Okay, what's next? Also, how much time do we have? We only have nine minutes left? Oh. Guys, can I say something? There's been a feeling that I've been having, especially now that my core days are down to just three, even though I'm going to be streaming um, like f four times a week most times. The feeling I've been having is like, I kind of, I want to, I want to four hours. A lot of streams recently that I've been enjoying, I'm like, it would, it would be nice Sometimes it's like, it's like, I feel like I'm just starting to gear up by the time the stream is ending, you know? But, I feel good. Butson, thank you for the seven. Thank you for the seven gift. That's very, very kind of you. Thank you a lot. I feel good. I knew that I would not. So good. So good. I'm on you. If you've got the energy, it's allowed. It's something that I would like to do. There's a couple of things. Um, I was just in a meeting. Is this okay? It would be good if this was the only picture of me on YouTube, on, on like Google images. If somebody searches me, it's, it's only this. And from now on, I will only be, when somebody says, can I have a picture of you to use for my uh, promotional post? I will be sending them this. So that's good. That's what your true self looks like within. Here's here's what I would say. I would love to do... Don't you cross over sometimes when it's Goo Crew business? Sometimes, but I kind of have my, um, my zone. Here's the other thing is... Uh, to be honest, I have a lot of uh, audience overlap with the Go Off Kings, and I owe them a great wealth of uh, gratitude and debt for the support that they've shown me. Sh like going over into their stream would be impolite to say the very least right to just like try to dr like they only stream for two hours you know i don't want to i don't know that it's it's impolite um and i don't always the wrong word but it's it's like you know i don't want to i i think it's i think it's reasonable to be cognizant of the effect that you have on other streamers in your circle, you know, but an hour earlier, then it's like, nobody is home from work yet. Fucking nobody is home from work yet an hour earlier. So that's, that's the struggle, but maybe, maybe I'll try it out a couple of times in the next couple of weeks. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, anyway, this week, Oh, I should say before the, while the stream is like closing in on like the last five minutes or whatever, um, this week is going to be a really good week for stream. Today has been a great stream, I think. Wednesday is going to be Crowd Control Skyrim, which is something that somebody... It's something that people have been telling me to do for, like, two or three months. Um, Skyrim with Crowd Control on. Very excited for that. Uh, because the Crowd Control streams are always an insane amount of fun, especially when it's a new game that we haven't fucked around with yet. I'm really excited for that. Um, Thursday is going to be the one video, three hours stream where we watch one, one minute and 12 second video for three hours, which means we'll probably watch it 170 times or 160 times. Um, that's going to be on Thursday. Uh, that's an experiment. And I hope that you'll be here with us to see what it, what it does to us psychologically. Saturday is going to be a mini a thon, which is, uh, it's like a sub a thon just to increase it from three to six hours. And maybe it won't go that long, or maybe we'll just have a nice, big, chunky six-hour stream because uh, I haven't done a stream that long since the last subathon. And I wanted a bigger stream and, uh, you know. Do you have a punishment lined up? Nope. But I'm also not going to fail. Anyway. It's Tony. Don't buy neon sign unless you buy from the neon signs manufacturer. The we got him, Leviosa. What's up, homie? I'm Tony. What should you do if you're a star without a man? 
What's up, dude? I'm Tony. This is a tempered glass panel. It can withstand three dudes standing on it. Me ho a homie. I'm Tony. What's with all the phone numbers? What's with all the phone numbers? Check out this standing light box. So I did cop, homie. Today I'll show you. So I did cop, homie. What you can do. Hey, no, homie. This is Dorney. The neon sign is much better priced than you think it is. Is he trying to. Is this. Is he trying to do like an Indian accent? Is what's up, homie? It's Tony. This is the Arado Light Box. Is that? Is it problematic? Don't say interesting, India. Don't. Do... <laughs> Don't say it. <laughs> Don't say interesting, India. What you're looking for? This is hanging on the wall. Lima how about homie? I think I think the funny thing is just that he's um, it's kind of funny. Tony. We have this fourteen years of the So me, I'm Tony. What's up, dude? I'm Tony. The neon. How? Pretty impressive. It's pretty pretty impressive. Pretty impressive. Okay. This next thing is what is this? I feel like I know this is going to suck already. Oh, this sucks so bad. <laughs> Don't take my eyes off the ball. All <laughs> again, you reel me out and you cut the string. Radiohead manualist. Can you do it? This is going to sound like cope. I don't want to do it. <laughs> and I know that that sounds like cope, but I promise you it's 100% sincere that I do not have any aspiration. I'm not jealous of him doing it. I'm not. I don't look at him and, and with envy, green with envy that I can't do what Brian Naked does. Okay. Was she sick? What happened to Ella? You're still with your friends by your side. You can hear the metronome in the background also, which is funny. Yeah. Hold on. Oh. Ella. This is the Ella. Oh, this is Ella. Still alive. My best friend Ella loves you recently got into a severe car accident. She was so appreciated if you sang her a song. And I hope you find a way. Wednesday, 327 on Spotify. He's putting the Ella song on Spotify. He's putting the Ella You Survived song on Spotify. <laughs> Thanks for the gift. It's up to Ella. To thrive, despite all the odds, you're here with your friends by your side. How did we find this guy at 8:58 p.m.? I know this is this is a this is a eleventh hour find, but we can return to him. We have potentially a six-hour stream on Saturday. Um, Ella was a big fan. She was watching his videos when she got in that accident. Like in her... Sorry, while she was driving. <laughs> that feels like maybe, maybe she doesn't... I'm not... Gonna, I, well, it's bad for me to say someone doesn't deserve sympathy, but maybe... <laughs> you know, maybe you could say... It's good you survived, and hopefully you learned something. Hopefully you also learned 
and survive. Also, she was wearing her homemade RoboCop suit. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Guys? The stream's over. The stream's over. The stream's over. Guys, this was a really fun one. This was a really fun one. Uh, wicked tired today. But always so happy to do the show. Um, since the readjust, I've been feeling a lot better. Saturday's show has me loving life. Because it was so much fun and so funny. Hopefully I can get more stuff like that. Do more stuff like that in the future. Um, yeah, I will see you all in two days on Wednesday for Crowd Control Skyrim. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, it's going to be a bunch of goofs and gaps. Crowd Control is chat controls what happens in the game. And they can spawn stuff into the game. Very excited for that. Um... And then Thursday and Saturday, I'm also streaming. Make sure to watch those. Join the Discord if you haven't. If you want to submit things for us to watch or look at or talk about on stream, put those in the submissions channels in the Discord. Those are the place to hang out. That's the place to hang out. There's great people in the Discord also. It's a very fun place to hang out. What else? Oh, yeah. Fucked Up Jeopardy 5 is on April 13th, which is in less than three weeks. So it's, it's going to sneak up on us. But get together for Fucked Up Jeopardy 5 in, in, on the 13th in about three weeks. Guys, thanks so much. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Who are we rating? When is the ye old stream? Uh, two days ago. I'm raiding Ricky. Tell Ricky that Dead Blossom Jesse sent you. That's my name. That's my. That's what my stream is called. My stream is called Dead Blossom Jesse. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs>